Hi, it's Dwyer, Wealthspin.blogspot.com. Let's go wealth spinning for March 21st, 2012. There is an excellent article in Opalesque, O P A L E S Q U E dot com on Jim Rogers' view on the economy. Jim Rogers is the gentleman who started the Quantum Fund many years ago with George Soros. Quite frankly, he is one of the world's best investors. He has a keen insight into the market. And Jim Rogers, quite frankly, believes that while 2012 might be good for the stock market, that the United States is overdue for a recession, which he sees happening in 2013 or 2014. The article notes the following. It quotes Rogers as saying, the overall situation is getting much worse because the debt is going through the roof for all of us. You should be worried about 2013, 2014, but overall 2012 won't look so bad. Right? The article goes on to talk about the increased debt load as well as the historical cycles of the United States economy. I believe it is a must read. We have linked the piece to wealthspin.blogspot.com. Also along those lines, Carl Denninger has given an extended and excellent interview on usawatchdog.com. And Mr. Denninger who operates market dash, excuse me, market dash ticker.org, an excellent site, expresses his thoughts that the EU debt crisis is far from over, that real estate still has further to drop in the United States, and that we're headed for another crash, in Mr. Denninger's opinion, before the end of the year. Okay, let's uh, lighten the mood a bit and talk about a report on SeekingAlpha.com that notes that Mario Gabelli and Gameco has actually increased its investment significantly in Clear Channel Outdoor Holdings. In fact, um, at the end of Q4, Gameco filed an SEC form SC13D-A indicating that it had increased its ownership of Clear Channel by more than 2 million shares. You definitely want to keep an eye on that. You want to check the piece on SeekingAlpha.com, we've linked the piece to Wealthspin.blogspot.com. Finally, let me just note an article on Yahoo's finance page that notes that Amazon has agreed to buy Kiva Systems for $775 million. I think this is a major acquisition. Uh, Kiva Systems is a robotics company. The technology is very advanced. It will allow Amazon to use robots to get boxes, open boxes, go through boxes in processing customer orders. Not surprisingly, Amazon is up since that news broke. Okay, let us know what you think. I hope you visit us at wealthspin.blogspot.com. Thanks for watching.